Angry Snake is a mod that adds a very angry long boy to the game. Good luck. Each snake has pathfinding and procedural animation similar to real snake locomotion. Are you serious? I gotta fact check this real quick. Can we get a fact check? Oh God. Oh, look at the procedural animations. They're so procedural. By procedural, did you mean that they're just a bunch of physics bodies tied together? Cause that is exactly what this looks like to me. Oh God, he's attacking me. Have mercy, you animal. Okay, well, we're gonna have to try something a little bit more heavy duty. He's dancing around. We killed him. I guess we're gonna have to hold a funeral for this poor being. He caused havoc for a total of 32 seconds. It was the most scary 32 seconds of my life. And that's why I loved him. Thank you. If anyone else wants to say some words, please go ahead. Dear God, would you look at him? He's terrifying. Is he coming this way? Is he coming this way? His head came straight off. Hold on, we have different versions of the snake. It's not just one snake. There's long snake. Dang, that's a long boy. This one is even more terrifying. Oh my God, he's faster. He's faster. Why did you make him faster? Oh wait, I see the snake locomotion now. Yeah, yeah it does kind of look like that. You're right. Okay, is this guy, is this guy gonna quit? Is this guy gonna quit? Oh, God. they do so much damage so fast. Oh, I couldn't even react. Oh my God, it was so terrifying. Die. I will put you in the dirt where you belong. Since you like playing in the dirt so much. All right, stop. I don't know what to do. We gotta tie him down. Okay. I think I, I put a leash on him. Oh wait, I think it broke off. Okay, the leash is still attached, but it did nothing. Um, shotgunned him down. Look at that snake is about 30 feet long. I should probably sell this at like a market or something. I bet it could go for a lot of money. It's a big snake pelt. You can make a snake rug. They don't even make snake rugs, but you could with this nice scaly rug, dragon rug. The rug is still in the concept phase. We don't need to worry about that. We also have a friendly snake. It's a friendly, you can drive it. That's what the friendly snake does. He doesn't damage you. He just likes to jump around and be your friend. And you can drive him. Okay, all right. I take back what I said about the snake locomotion. I like this. This is the best, this is the best part of the snake mod. I am a snake now. How many cylinders is this snake? Pioneers used to drive these puppies. I love you, snake. I love you and your third eye. I don't know why you have three eyes. This is what we've all been waiting for. How do I enable this? I turned on the vehicle booster mod. It's not working. Oh, it is working. It is working. It doesn't do much. Try and get me now, snake. Mano e mano. All right, the vehicle booster makes this incredibly unwieldy. Dude! Back to the depths with you, snake worm. You know, I figured out what's wrong with you. You're just a, you're just a little bit of a spaz. There we go. I don't understand why it's not working. It says the vehicle's in near perfect condition. This makes no sense to me. Alrighty then. How much will you give me for this hunk of meat here, salesman? This goes for a pretty penny, top dollar, top coin. I will let you have this for only five thousand dollars. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You can't afford this. I will be taking my business elsewhere. This is the finest friendly snake hide you will ever find. All right? Don't mess with me and my gang. You have to be able to kill these guys by running them over, right? That's a thing. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna cut you off at the neck. If I could <laughs> drive this Roblox noob directly into you, that one hurt you. I can tell that one hurt you. No, please. No, he killed me through the car. What? That's impossible. Hey, guess what? Roblox remove ticks. Introducing the brand new Impact Body by Udomatic. I like this guy. He's done some pretty cool mods in the past. So let's give it a shot. What does the Impact Body have that Snake Longboy doesn't? Stand up, soldier. Why is he falling over like that? Stand up. Oh, oh, oh my God, he did. You can throw him over and he has a chance to stand back up or something. Get up. Maybe if you pick him up, put him on his feet. Oh, that's so cool. If you KO him, he will stay down and submit. But if you pick him back up on his feet, yeah, he's a chance. He has a chance that he'll figure out the rotation. Oh my God. And he does a little freaking thing with his legs. What's that little dance you do with your legs? I like that. Dude, keep doing that. Keep doing that. Don't stop believing. And the best part about this guy is he doesn't try to kill me instantly as soon as I put him in the game. He actually is just happy standing around doing nothing, which is what I like to do 90% of my day. And boy, can this guy take a punch. And he he never cares. It's incredible. I have an idea with uh, the magnet. What if I magnetize his foot and his... Uh-oh. Get up. Are you all right? Are you okay? Are you okay? Oh, my God. Thank God. He's fine. 
All right, new test. All right, scratch that. I'm gonna back up a little bit. New test. All right, I'm gonna back up a little bit more. New test. Oh! Ah, oh, no! He fell off the map. Right, I'll spot a new one. I'll spot a couple of them. Check out these guys. Ah, check them out. Tell your brother to get up. We're doing business today, boys. All right, if you guys don't want to end up like that guy over there, then listen to me. The challenge is survive the angry snake. The victor will forever live in Valhalla. That is for sure. Okay, all right, guys, we got to get out of here. The snake's coming, boys. He's coming straight for me. Somebody do something. He's going to kill me. He's going to kill me, boys. All right, there's only one way to kill him. Hold still, gentlemen. Make them conjoined brothers. Oh my god. Don't fall into the ground. Why don't you have any collisions, my guy? All right, stand up on your feet. I'm not gonna say it again. All right. You're useless. You're the new guy. You are the new man. Okay, and action. And action. What, what is wrong with you people? What is wrong with you? I'm welding you together. <laughs> they are now one being. I have created life beyond the human form. It's like two humans put together. It's my new invention. This is not working out that well, but I will make it even better with magnetism. Magnetism for the win. I've also downloaded this cannon here, which I don't really, I don't know what it is. It has like a little wick only when you're holding on to it. I have an idea. Blowtorch, where is it? Come on, light it. How do you turn it on? Ah, yes, we have the lighting stick here, which I imagine is how we light it. That would make a lot of sense. I just got to put something inside of the cannon. Hopefully it'll fit. Square peg. I think that's that's basically in. That's basically in. Oh my god! That was impressive. It's still going. That created a ridiculous amount of smoke and also broke the ground. I love this device. I have an incredible use for this impact dummy here he is all right we're gonna line up the cannon and we're gonna see what happens your time has almost come my son good luck i love you daddy loves you remember that are you serious man my one chance to get rid of you i uh, wasn't lined up correctly that's my bad that's my bad you know what that's why we have all these cannonballs so we can give it another shot get it we're gonna shoot him again all right tally ho onward my good man to the great beyond I should really start standing in front of these. We get the radius right. We gotta get the angle right. My God, this is so complicated. All right, stand right there. Don't move. Don't move. I moved the cannon by mistake when I put the freaking ball in. That's as lined up as it gets right there. There's no way I miss this. Ah! We have done it. We did it for real. Are you, are you all right? Oh, yep, yeah, he's good. Can we put more than one cannonball in this machine? You have to, right? That, that has to be a thing. All right, we stick it way down there. All the way in the back. We need to make room for two. Two cannonballs. If you can believe that. Ooh, perfect. We got two in there. All right. Angle this down just a little bit. Get in positions, everyone. Oh, my God. You look perfect. Okay, hold that. Hold that. This is going to be money. Oh, what? Ah! <laughs> they both did come out. This one did not make it very far. But why would we keep using that stupid baby small cannon when we have this massive cannon that I can't even pick up on my own? I need to have industrial help. I think spawning the cannonballs like this probably be a lot quicker to fill up. Sayonara. <laughs> it actually works. Oh my God. <laughs> Get in there. You're our good luck charm. Without you, nothing even happens. Hey, hey. Hey, stop. Stop squirming around. Get in there. How would we know what happens with science if you do not go in there? That is my best argument that I could think of. Goodbye. Ladies and gentlemen, I just have to see what is going to happen if I shoot myself out of the cannon. So right now I'm going to recycle these cannonballs because that's what we do over here at Bandy Co. We recycle, we reuse the cannonballs. We use it for personal stunts and accompanied by this amazing and trustworthy ladder that I have built, we will most likely be able to reach the stratosphere. The only issue is that I need to light this cannon and then run up the ladder as fast as I possibly can. And sometimes it doesn't work. I won't know until I hear the sound. There it is. There it is. Oh, it worked. Let's go! Oh, I'm in zero G. Oh my God. Are we falling? 
Oh, yeah, we're, we're, we're falling. Brace for impact. Move the ladder. It's priceless. Oh, no. We didn't move it.